Okay, teachers, I'm going to make uh, a, a quick video here that uh, is designed to show you how to set up your Promethean board. If you want to wait until I, I get there, great, but if you want to uh, jump in and, and start this, um, it's pretty simple to do. There's two things to do to turn on your Promethean board. <clears throat> the first thing is we're going to go, if I can get the camera to work, we're going to go to the side here left side and behind the Promethean board and you'll see this little um, right here this little uh, computer and right down here in the corner I can't quite get my camera around to that but right down here in the corner there's a little round button you can feel for it and when you push that button in you'll see there's a blue light you see the blue light just came on right here and that tells you the computer is on we're gonna go around the front now and down in the front here, if we turn on the panel by pushing that button in, the panel light uh, lights up green and we have a, our panel lights up. So as you can see, uh, turning on the computer and turning on the display, we have a splash screen that comes up. And all I'm going to do is light that up. There we go. And it's going to uh, allow me to log in. Now, um, I, as you can see, I've already logged into this one. For you, what you'll want to do is come over here and type or tap other user. And that'll bring this panel up. Then go over to this icon in the center and touch it. Make your computer easier. To and choose on-screen on screen. keyboard. When the keyboard comes up, again, tap username, and you'll be able to type in your username to log in to the Promethean board. And then I'm going to tap password. and tap the arrow next to password and it'll log us in to, uh, to the display and you're ready to go. To use the display, um, because it is touch, uh, touch sensitive to launch something, all you have to do is double click it. So if I want to watch launch Chrome, I'm just going to double click that. Up comes my Chrome and I can get to whatever I need to here. I can even get my email here, so as you can see, I've logged into my Google account. Okay, teachers, the other thing I wanted to show you with your Promethean boards, for those who want to set up their document cameras, I'm going to show you how to do that now. As you can see, I've got a document camera on a cart right next to my Promethean board. The document camera does have to be fairly close uh, so that the cable will reach. And I've got my power to my document camera and I've got my VGA cord, a VGA cord already plugged in to VGA out and the other end of this cord runs around and you can see it comes up under the left bottom left corner of the Promethean board. Let me see if I can get down there and show you where that is. Right up underneath you can see Maybe you can see. Good grief. Can I? There we go. There's the VGA cable plugged into the bottom of the uh, Promethean board. But even though my document camera is turned on, and it is on, you can see I've got a blue light, I've got a book in place, but I've got no image. So what we have to do is go down in front to this little door here, open it up, and inside here you're going to see several buttons and one of them is going to have a VGA symbol which is right here. I'm going to push that and there's my document camera image. The only problem is you can see that my book is oriented the way I want but the image isn't showing up the way I want. So what I'd like to do is rotate this 90 degrees. I'm going to show you how to do that very quickly. All you have to do is go over to your document camera push the menu button. The menu will come up on your screen. As you can see, the third item down is rotate. Going back to my document camera, I'm going to push the down arrow and as I do that, you'll see the line goes down. Once rotate is underlined, I'm going to go back, go to the right arrow, arrow and push that one time so I've got 90 degrees showing up under rotate. Then I'm going to go back, turn off the menu and now you can see that my image and my book are aligned. So if you're having that problem, that's, that's how you fix it.
Okay, the only other thing to do now is show you how to get back to your computer when you're done using your document camera and you want to get your computer back up on your display. You go back here to this little uh, panel at the bottom of the Promethean board and right next to the VGA button there is a symbol for HDMI. I'm going to push that button one time and that's going to take me to HDMI 1. When I see HDMI 1, I'm going to push the button again. That'll take me to HDMI 2. And that's where our computer is. It's on input HDMI 2. If you have any questions, let me know.